you listen to your party and coalition leader there. He raises more issues than what the president appeared to make suggestions to, because his suggestions was his suggestion actually was specific to the IABC selection panel, the reconstitution of that. Uh, but your party leader is talking about more issues. So how do you make the bipartisan approach to address all those issues at a time that the president has only spoken about one issue? Uh, Sam, <clears throat> I just didn't listen to my party lead. Mm -hmm. I was part and parcel <laughs> uh, of the process mm -hmm. that came up with uh, mm -hmm. those issues. Right. And uh, those issues are not new, if you have been keen enough. Uh, we have raised those issues time and again. Right. In fact, uh, some of them are part of the four issues that we had, uh, four conditions mm -hmm. that we had given that need have been met mm -hmm. before you could do. Uh, uh, call off the mass action. You know, your continued reference to the president has said this, the president has, is neither here nor there. What Honorable Bruto did was to give suggestions on behalf of his Kenya Kwanzaa coalition. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and my party leader, uh, the right Honorable Raila Amolo Odinga, gave counter proposals. There was no hard rule that this counter proposal should be one, two, three, four, ten. No. He just actually repeated the same, same uh, conditions, issues that we have been raising uh, from, the very, uh, from the very beginning. Mm -hmm. And therefore, those proposals and counter proposals must naturally therefore form uh, the basis uh, for engagement okay. before the main talks. I want to repeat this. There is no way you can just get into a, a so-called bipartisan committee in Parliament without agreeing on the rules of the game. It can never happen. It will never happen. Yeah, and you know we have got. You don't think yes. Parliament is? Allow me to use this word competent enough to deal with all those issues. Parliament is one of the problems <laughs> that we have highlighted over and over, over and over and again. My party leader has just spoken to the fact that in Parliament, MPs have been bought. Mm -hmm. And therefore, as we speak, Kenya Kwanzaa is enjoying artificial majority. Mm -hmm. So before you address the issue of that artificial majority and how it can come into play in, the, in, in respect to how to implement the recommendations of the committee, then you're not doing anything. So, so we are not children, and neither are we fools, <laughs> to get into something we, we are not clear about or not sure about. So, so we support the bipartisan approach. We are committed to uh, the idea of a bipartisan committee in parliament, but we want to agree on the preliminary issues beforehand. Even when the president says that um, a bipartisan approach means that it's reason that is going to reign, not necessarily the numbers, that doesn't convince you? Well, you know, I'm not saying uh, I, uh, 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 that does not convince me. What I'm saying is, even if I'm convinced <laughs> as a person, and eventually uh, we don't get the, the results that we desire as a country, what will, what will be the use? So what we need is a structured engagement with mm. concrete uh, 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 proposals on how to go about this business. So, so and that's not too much to ask for, really. And uh, I don't think it should even take us more than two or three days to, to trust those issues. Yeah.